In a high stakes showdown, former President Donald Trump is vying for a decisive victory in the South Carolina primary, aiming to secure his fourth consecutive win and deal a significant blow to his last major rival Nikki Haley for the Republican nomination. Trump, the dominant frontrunner, has enjoyed a substantial lead in the polls and support of key Republican figures in the state. However, Haley, the former UN ambassador and two-time South Carolina governor, has relentlessly crisscrossed the state, asserting that the 77-year-old Trump is too old and distracted to reclaim the presidency. In a state where the winner of the Republican primary has historically gone on to become the party's nominee, all eyes are on this crucial contest. Even as Trump positions himself for a potential general election rematch against President Joe Biden, Haley remains steadfast in her commitment to continue the race regardless of the outcome. Trump's backers, many of whom had supported Haley during her gubernatorial tenure, expressed confidence in a solid victory on Saturday, aligning with the former president's ongoing large rallies and fundraising events across the country. In response, Haley has seized on moments from Trump's rallies to bolster her argument against him. Trump's comments about her husband's absence on the campaign trail while on a National Guard deployment became an ammunition for Haley who framed it as evidence that the frontrunner lacks respect for service members and their families. Trump's statements on encouraging countries like Russia to act as they please against NATO members, failing to meet defence spending targets, have given Haley another line of attack. She characterises these moments as evidence of Trump's volatility and perceived weakness in dealing with Russia. In a strategic move, Haley has extended an indirect appeal to Democrats, urging those who skipped their own primary to participate in the Republican contest. She emphasized that anyone who abstained from the Democratic primary on February 3rd is welcome to vote in this critical Republican primary. As the South Carolina primary unfolds, the political landscape is on edge, with the nation watching closely to see whether Trump can secure his fourth consecutive victory or if Haley will defy expectations and continue her campaign, setting the stage for a prolonged and contentious battle for the Republican nomination. Subscribe to One India channel and never miss an update.